Hey guys, I'm here. I'm um, doing an unboxing today. So, um, I don't know if many of you are aware of uh, before we had like um, stuff was going out of stock like crazy. It looks like they restocked most of it. So, when I restock, uh, saw that they restocked a lot of uh, Isengard stuff, I was like, <clears throat> just take my money. So, I made a pretty big uh, Isengard purchase, um, partly for our campaign. And I keep talking about it, and we've been talking about it for a while, but we just want to make sure we have, like, a really big collection. Like, for our, I mean, I could have done it with Elves at Rohan, but I was like, well, I really wanted to have a, a big collection for my Isengard, because I wanted to run my Isengard. So, um, I'll go over what I bought. Um, unbox. Um, so first guy I got was Mahur. Uh, he is a, um, Isengard captain. Uh, he, he has the ability to give, um, scouts 8-inch movement. Uh, he himself is pretty beast, um, three attack, uh, so, yeah, he's a, re he's a really good hero, and he's relatively cheap in points, so, he's in the book, he's not in the movie, I don't think he's in the movie, he represented at least, but he's in the book, um, for, I think he was reinforcing the, remember, actually, sorry, he was reinforcing the uh, Isengard either at Helm's Deep or uh, against Dance, I don't remember, or against Rohan. Uh, aimers guys sorry uh, I don't remember but so I'm gonna crack them open um, if you're under the age of uh, 12 then ask a parent or guardian before cutting open I actually um, cut my finger opening the box wasn't paying attention so But yeah, it's um been busy with school. So that's why I haven't been pumping as many videos. Um We actually have a ping pong table and we used to game on it when I lived in Colorado. Um and we put that together today or yesterday. So we're thinking that's how we're gonna start trying to film it, you know, in my garage. Um it has a little bit better lighting. Uh, maybe we can set more of a studio atmosphere. Have, um, you know. Okay. So, he's, um, resin. Um, as most of the Isengard stuff is. He comes with one base instead of four. Of and, um, here's the model. He's, uh, Looks like he's in pretty good shape. He has three parts. Him and uh, his two swords it looks like you kind of just plug into his hands a lot like the King's Champion model. Uh, he will require quite a bit of cleaning up, unfortunately. But other than that, he looks good. I don't see any miscasts. But yeah, he's a beast. Okay, so second purchase is I bought another four um, of these crossbow Urukai. I really like the ones I have. I only have uh, six of them. I want to have a full warband eventually, but like the games I've had, and you can see on films, uh, going back to battle reports, is crossbows with Vrasku, man, they just tear. They're probably the best unit of shooting in the game. So, um, they're pretty much Urukai, the yeah, crossbows. Um, I'll crack them open. I'm not exactly sure. Like, you can argue evil has not as good shooting, but Isengard, crossbow or Akai, if you can have a, a solid amount, like, I'd say you don't necessarily have to have a full warband. I want a full warband. That's just me personally. I think a full warband would, um, would be really devastating, especially against armies like Gondor. Like, against, uh, you didn't see it. Oh. Actually, this has the, the actual packaging on it. So I'll show you. I don't think it... Yeah, it says fine cast. It's kind of weird. I guess because they got resupplied from uh, stores, maybe. Because stores, they're sending back um, stuff. Back to the warehouse. I think that's the deal. So yeah, it's an old box. Uh, they don't do the fine cast technically anymore. Okay. Dropped it. Don't want to do that. 
Okay. This comes with four bases, which is appropriate because there's four models. There's them two. And then there's those two. So there's four of them total. Um, they'll give me ten plus rest. All right. Uh, then I got it's kind of like I kind of my royal guard. I got two boxes of them, so I'll only will unbox one. But I got these berserkers. One thing I've really wanted from Isengard. I only I don't have any. I mean I have the two that come with the siege equipment. But I wanted a warband of them. Um, I actually stat wise these guys are. Um, Better than ferals. I think a lot of people like ferals, but to be honest with, I don't really see. I mean, they're like Urkai scouts essentially. I think um, these guys are, you know, two attacks, uh, defense six, high courage. They're a good, a good unit to have. I, I put them over um, feral Urkai personally. So I got eight of them, and plus I'm just gonna go and use the two that came with the siege gear. Unless I'm doing a siege, then I'll use them as how they're supposed to be. So that'll give me ten of them. Um, so I'll have ten of each. And then maybe I'll get another, bo another box each. I'll have more than twelve, but it's okay. Okay. So, I know Buddy got these a while ago in Fine Cast. Yeah. Oof, that's bad. It's like flail is bent and curved all up. And these ones aren't too bad. That's what they look like. So, I hope you guys enjoyed my unboxing. Um, I tried to put some up, uh, give you guys some content. Uh, we're going to be starting our gaming soon. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please like, subscribe, and comment. And happy wargaming.